All right, welcome everybody. I think in the interest of time, we're gonna go ahead and kick things off. Thank you so much for coming. We are so excited to host the first Saturday, Saturday's Columbus event. Um, obviously, you know, we had maybe thought at the start that this might be in person, but we're super excited to offer it in a virtual format for free. Uh, and we thank you all for being here with us on, uh, on this Saturday. So just a little bit um, to start, just some kind of uh, you know, organizational things that we'll cover, and then we'll jump right into the good stuff, the talks. So uh, throughout the day, please uh, get us on Twitter at Saturdays underscore org, so you can see that account right here, um, and use the hashtag Saturday Columbus uh, just to comment about any talks you're seeing throughout the day. So this will kind of be our, our medium for comments and exciting things you're seeing and, and retreating that content. Um, so hit us up on Twitter. And so um, just a little bit about, uh, we'll tell you a little bit about Saturdays. Um, this, uh, we'll go over more about what Saturdays are in general on the next slide, um, but just kind of give you a sense of the scale that we were able to accomplish for this Saturday's Columbus event. We have about 300 plus res re registrants. Um, hopefully everybody will join us today. We have 17 different speakers and hosts um, and organizers who are really excited about the talks you guys are gonna see today, some good content. Um, and as you'll learn more about on the next slide, this is actually part of a global, global series of events. These Saturdays events and conferences have been put on um, around the world uh, by different community organizers. So it's a community-led group. Um, and the, the idea is to feature speakers from the local community areas and to offer a free or low-cost conference uh, venue. So just like I said, these are international events. It's a really cool thing. You guys can start one in your own area if you are not from uh, Ohio. Uh, it was launched in 2016. Um, it is a you know, kind of relatively new project. Um, but again, the goal is uh, to get communities involved in the, our studio community and beyond. Um, it's a great, rich, open source community. And the goal is to kind of feature that in a low cost conference. So events are always organized by local community members, usually about 100 to 250 people. Uh, and Saturdays in the past have been sponsored by the R Consortium and the Linux Foundation um, and other open source projects that are supporting the international R community. So we thank you guys for joining. If you have any more questions about Saturdays, um, feel free to you know, hit up one of the organizers on uh, Twitter. Um, and then you'll see later on that we will be using Slido throughout the day for questions, so general Q&A questions or questions for speakers. All right, um, just a little bit on our code of conduct for today. Um, so at this point, I think we are probably all uh, used to attending virtual events. Um, but just code of conduct in general for any Saturday's event um, that we'd like you guys to keep in mind. We're dedicated to providing a harassment-free and inclusive conference experience for all in attendance, um, regardless of gender, sexual orientation, disabilities, physical attributes, um, age, ethnicity, social standing, etc. cetera. Um, so we, we take that seriously. Um, so we're not gonna tolerate any sort of harassment um, or innuendos in either talks, presentations, or comments. Um, so we just ask that you be respectful of our code of conduct. Um, and this is the global code of conduct for any Saturday's event that you'll, you'll see. And if you have any issues at all, please feel free to email the organizers at saturday.columbus at gmail.com. Um, so any issues at all with the code of conduct um, or general questions about Saturdays, you can feel free to direct there. And after I'm done presenting, I'll go ahead and throw that email in the chat. So that way you guys have that on hand. And um, if you want to learn more about the code of conduct, you can find that site here or you can use this QR code. So just a little bit about uh, the organizers that brought you this great event today, and you'll be hearing more from each and every one of us throughout the day. Um, but we've got a boss Risby from Tempest Labs, Bernie Lawson, um, who works for a um, major kind of retail consultant down in Cincinnati. Esgi Kreisman is currently at Nationwide Children's Hospital. Uh, Esgi also finished an internship at our studio on the Tidy Models team this summer, so we're excited to have Esgi on board. John Blischak, um, Blischak, sorry, John. Um, so John is one of our organizers. John's a freelance uh, scientific software developer um, out of the Cleveland area. So another great Ohio R community member. You'll hear more from John later today. Um, and then myself, um, Katie, 
uh, Schaefer. I work at um, Beam Dental, uh, and I'm excited to be with you guys today. All right. So a bit on some rules of engagement here. Again, this is starting to become old hat after you've gone to some virtual events, um, but we're gonna keep everybody on mute unless you're an active speaker um, presenting. So we will have you muted, um, but we do ask you to use your video if you can. We understand um, you know, that might not be feasible at, for the entire time throughout the conference. If you're not comfortable, that is okay. Um, but as a speaker, it's really nice to see that feedback from people uh, as, as they're talking. So if you can use your video, leave it on. Um, but if you need to go ahead and turn that off, we understand. We will be using slido.com for any Q&A for speakers um, or you know, kind of general Q&A, please go to slido.com. And then once you get to slido.com, you'll need to enter the hashtag Saturday Columbus. And again, I, I will throw this in the chat out to everybody when this presentation's over in case you forget. Um, but for Q&A, uh, slido.com, hashtag Saturday Columbus will get you there. All right, and then I already mentioned um, how to find us on Twitter, and this is kind of for general comments and feedback. Okay, so next up, um, I wanted to introduce Matt from Root Insurance. Root Insurance is one of our great sponsors here today. Um, so Root is actually our virtual sponsor. Uh, they would have been our uh, event sponsor had we been able to have this in person. So they have graciously um, offered us uh, you know, a great platform for hosting the event. So I'll let Matt just tell you a little bit more about Root. Hi everyone, I'm Matt Benoctopor, I'm the VP of Data Science at Root. Just gonna say a few words about Root and our data science team. So for those of you who don't know Root, um, we're an insurance company headquartered in Columbus, Ohio. Our core product is auto insurance. We also offer renters and homeowners as well. Uh, the way our auto product works is that if you want insurance from us, you download our app and you give permission for us to collect data from the sensors on your smartphone. Once you do that, you've entered what we call the test drive. For two to three weeks, when you start driving, we wake up in the background on the phone collect data from the sensors on the smartphone multiple times per second, and go back to sleep when you stop driving. Um, once we collect enough data on you, we'll, we'll, collect, we'll construct a telematics risk score and use some demographic information to produce a quote. You'll get the quote in the app, you can buy it in the app and then administer your policy in the app. So data science interacts with this process in a number of different ways on the back end. We largely focus on four core problems, telematics, pricing, reserving and lifetime value analytics. We're heavy R users, so if you're interested in any of these problems, we encourage you to check out our open positions at joinroot.com slash careers, or send Brian an email, brian.croft at joinroot.com. And by the way, we have other quantitative positions available too in our product analytics team and our actuarial team. Thanks. Awesome, thanks so much, Matt. So check that out if you're interested. Um, they've got a really, really awesome statistics and data science team over at Root. So it'd be a good place to be. Okay. Um, our marketing sponsor, so this is our first time doing this. So we had some marketing collateral Collateral we wanted to create. Um, so we wanted to thank AWARE for that. Um, AWARE uh, basically helps companies satisfy different governance, risk compliance, and um, uh, other requirements by taking unstructured conversation data and garnering insights from it. So you can check them out. Um, their uh, website is um, awarehq.com. So I'll get that in the chat at some point today if you want to learn more. And then um, I will introduce Warner Moore from TCC Tech Community Coalition. Uh, they are an amazing sponsor. Warner will tell you a little bit more about them. Um, but we will also be um, taking donations to TCC, which is a nonprofit, throughout the day. So in lieu of a small registration fee, if you would like to donate, I will get that link in the chat. Um, but let me uh, let Warner tell you a little bit more about what TCC is and how they support the open source community. Good morning, folks. Happy Saturday. My name's uh, Warner Moore, like Katie said, and I'm the founder of Tech Community Coalition. We're really proud to be the sponsor of Saturdays today and uh, glad to be with you here today on the inaugural event here in Columbus. We support community organizations like Saturday you know, through uh, providing fiscal sponsorship and resources to their leadership, like your Saturday team here. We also pollinate activities throughout the greater Columbus technology and startup communities to enable us to get to know each other doing things in different groups. If you'd like to learn more, check out techcc.org 
And uh, thanks so much again, Katie and Saturdays for having me. Enjoy and have a great event. Awesome. Thanks so much, guys. So I, I will throw that into the chat. Um, and again, any donation you do provide to TCC helps organizations like us with our financial backing. Um, so instead of us having to register as a nonprofit and set up accounts and all of that, TCC helps with that. And then they also help the broader community by organizing a ton of uh, great events. Okay, so getting into the good stuff. Um, the rough agenda for today, just to give you guys a sense of where we are headed. Um, we are kind of right on track here. We're going to have our morning session on infrastructure, and then we'll eat, introduce each of the sessions throughout the day. We'll have some breaks in between, um, but we have kind of uh, carved these sessions out into infrastructure, hobbies, and then we've got some good content on modeling um, and communication as well. So I'm going to go ahead and um, kick it over to um, Abbas, I believe, and Abbas is going to kind of just walk us through the morning session. Um, as well as our uh, keynote speaker, Jim Hester, who we're super excited to have today. So Abbas, I will let you take it away. 